Good morning, Builder News. I just saw a thing pop up on Hacker News and I thought, oh my goodness, I gotta give this a try. It's called Show HN Rejected by YC. I have been accepted by YC the first two times I applied. Actually, I only applied once. I got in first time and then the second time I did a startup, I didn't even apply, but Paul Graham was like, like, uh, you got to do YC again. I didn't want to. And anyway, he, he, I did it again because he gave me an offer I couldn't refuse. He gave me YC for 3%. Anyway, and that company went on to invent the technology that I still work on today. So smart move by PG. But then they've rejected that company about fucking 15 times or whatever since. I've been rejected by YC probably more than anybody, even though the first two times I got in. Anyway, fucking YC. And I got kicked out of YC. So anyway, let's, if anyone has been rejected by YC, I think I probably, I'm the number one. Is this a, if this is a leaderboard, I'll be number one. Let's take a look at what the hell is this. Rejected by YC, a curated list of companies and founders rejected by YC. Oh, it's curated. Okay, I love it. Founders, Sarah Hum, evidence, don't be sorry. Aha, we got rejected by YC and didn't try investment by investor chat. So weird. Current companies. Okay. Um, Peter Levels. I was rejected for one. People like him. Working on full time. Levels VC. What's this Levels? Therapist. Peter, Ben. Wait, is this the guy who was just on um, on um, that podcast that everyone was talking about? Alex McCaw. Contra. Um, Series B. Oh, I love this site. I love this site. This is just com.com YC rejected com cameo send grid Tyler Trinius ghost starter story um cal.com submit a rejected company or oh, oh copyright gross gross get rid of that get rid of that and I'll submit um I love the site how do I submit? Is this just a Google form? Now, watch this. Watch this, rejected by YC. Let's go ahead and we're gonna rebuild your site on Scroll Hub, okay? So this is live now. And we're gonna, okay, so that's, you've got a source link. You've got three columns. You have a link to, what's that, to the Twitter, okay? And then you've got a submit, so, um, Let's say rejected by YC. Let's put two minutes on the clock. We're gonna call it at, at um, five minutes. Rejected by YC, a curated list of YC companies rejected by YC. What does the asterisk mean? Okay, you've got a footer. Okay, let me just put that in the footer. Create a footer file. And then we're gonna move that to the footer. Okay, and then to include a file in um, scroll, all you have to do is type the file name. Um, so now we've got that, this works okay. And then we're gonna go ahead and take a look at how our website's coming together. Um, let me print the title. Okay, um, and now let's do the table. So what do we have? We have founder, evidence, and we have current companies. Um, so let's do data.scroll. Let's build a scroll, start a scroll set. Convert a CSV to scroll set. So we have founder, Twitter, um, evidence, uh, link, and now. We'll call it now for what, what they're currently doing. Um, so founder, oh my goodness, we're going to run out of time. All right, we're going to, we're going to extend the time by a minute. Let's put this first bit of data in here. Do, 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 do. Frederick, so the thing you're looking at, fucking scrolling all this was something rejected by YC. So what better way to build rejected by YC than a the tool 
built by a company rejected by YC. Okay, copy link address. So this is the link for the evidence. And then the evidence itself is going to be this text right here. La -da 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 -da. Do, 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 do. What is Dune? It's a movie. You know it's a movie. What else is it? I don't know. Oh, they got Dune.com though. We'll have to take a look at that. So right now they're working on Dune.com. Okay, so now we've got our scroll set. We have our schema. So this is like our database schema. We're gonna call it we're gonna call it rejects.parser. Oops. Ah, I always do that. It should actually be rejects.parsers. I need to fix that bug. So rejects.parsers. We need it, um, and then we go back to this, and let's rename this guy to rejects.scroll. Sorry, rejects. Don't worry. I'm going to put my own self on here. Um, so what, what am I doing wrong here? This should be, this, this, this little tool has got a bug. Um, that's okay, because we don't really need it, because it's so easy. Um, I'm just gonna put, I'm gonna change that to name, rec units, Twitter, rec units, evidence. Okay, so I gotta add that later for my, my own self. But for this guy, for Frederick, name. So what we're doing now is we're, we're editing our database by hand. This is plain text. Um, plain text backed by git um, I'm just going to rename evidence to story I think story is going to be a better better name um, link we'll call it source yeah we'll call it source and then we'll call this the now what they're working on now um, alright so that's that's it. I'm just gonna get rid of myself for now because my story's not on there. So then we're gonna include rejects.parsers. Again, we just have to write the file name on our own line to do the include. Okay. And then what do we do? We changed this to story. Um, how do they describe their rejection? We're gonna change this to name. What is the founder's name? What is their Twitter? We should have the autocomplete here, but we don't yet. We'll get it. I think I call this the source. Um, description. What is a link to the source of the story? To verify, whatever. Description. What are they working on now? Working on it. And now this one is a URL. We knew that. Okay. Story is a string. Twitter is a URL. This, this we're going to make the ID. Okay. And that just tells the code where to um, to. So then we're going to just do. Okay. We go back into rejects. Let's do. Watch this, build concepts, and then we're gonna say rejects.json, rejects.csv, rejects.tsv. Why not just make them all? Um, and now, so now it'll, now it will build all those files. So we got all those things here. And then if we go back into our index file, and we do table, rejects.tsv, print table, all right. Here we go. Let's let's use a theme. Let's use a theme that has a little bit better table support. Gazette does. Okay, so that's basics. Let's throw a little search in there and, and allow to sort. All right. So there we go. We've got Twitter. Let's make his name clickable. So let's watch this. We're gonna go ahead and rename Twitter to name link, and then that will just merge those two. Um, columns and then let's do story um, we'll do we'll do story link I guess 
um, rename store, uh, source to story link. Just make the whole thing a link for now. And of course we can stylize this and stuff later. So we can see, okay, that looks great. And now who made this guy? Created by Leo. Of course we gotta put Leo up top. Um, created by Leo. Um, this version by Breck. And then look at how we do links, it's so easy. You put the link after the text. Let's, uh, let's take a look at how it's coming along. Created by Leo, this version by Breck. Original by Leo. Now we should team up, Leo. You should make this one the real one. You can even just point that domain to this IP address and um, original by Leo. Okay. Um, let me move this up because I saw a flicker. Um, so get rid of that flicker. Okay, great. Um, so anyway, that's the basics. And now, but now look, because we've got this, we've got, um, let's go into our footer. Let's make a header. Sorry. Let's make a header. Let's do build it. Let's just write import only. We don't want to build an HTML file called header. Um, so, or do we? No, we don't. No. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe. We might. All right, we'll put the meta tags in there. What else do we need in the header? Let's build a text version of the site. All right. Um, what else would we need in a header? Let's put a home button. Why not? Um, then let's move that. Let's move the theme into the header. We don't need this anymore. Let's just include that header.scroll file. Um, so we can we can move the theme in here. So let's see how the site is coming along. Rejected by YC. We got a home button. We got search. We've got source. Let's go into the footer there. And um, watch this. JSON link to rejects.json. So now someone could get the, the JSON of your, your table. Anyway, this just shows some basics. Let's go back to the original real quick. Let's add another one in here. Um, I don't know what buffer is, but let's add this one. Um, Let's go back into, what do we call it? Rejected by YC, oops. Um, Regx.scroll, um, name, Joel. Joel and his link is Twitter. So what we're doing is we're doing structured data. Buffer. I keep see seeing Buffett. I keep thinking Warren Buffett. Now, what is he doing? Um, boom. All right. So, here we go. It's coming alive. Rejected by YC. Oh my goodness, that took 14 minutes. A little bit slow. No, I saw a lot of opportunities for us to improve things. And of course, we haven't even gotten to the point of adding LLMs yet. So that's going to be a, that's a very simple to do. Um, just haven't gotten to it. Anyway, rejected by YC. I am I'm a founding member of that club. <laughs> YC used to be fucking great. And they jumped the shark at some point. They stopped innovating. They became secretive and clicky and closed source and fr fratty and it's, they need a shake up. They need a shake up. And I'm glad that uh, people are criticizing them because 
they they've got their earmuffs on they they just like don't listen to any feedback from people who love them and help them build their community so i hope they change their ways there's hope there's hope yet and thank you leo let's give you a follow leo um for for building this this is great cheers <laughs>